everyone, it's our first day here in Hong Kong and we're getting ready to go to Ngong Ting Village. At if kakaya pa sa time namin, we might go to Sky Terrace. We already booked our ticket to Klok. And medyo malamig sa Hong Kong ngayon because it's cold season here. So yung outfit namin pang cold dress. Si Jeff, ready na siyang umalis. Time check, it's already 8 in the morning. The first thing that we're gonna do is we will... 8.23. 8.23. So it's already 8.23. And first thing in our agenda is to visit Ping Village. We will take a cable car there. Which first time namin ita try ni Jeff, and I am so excited because the first time dun namin dito sa Hong Kong actually. Before that, I'm going to get ready na kasi aalis na kami. So for my skirt, I'm gonna have this pleated skirt that I got from Full and Bear. This is actually extra small. Wala kasi siya ng small, so I took this one. At medyo kumasya naman sa akin. Yen sakto sakto lang talaga siya. And I really love the fit of this, guys. And for my top naman, I'm gonna have this turtleneck that I got from H&M. And it's also in a size of small. Para matchy matchy kami ni Jeff kasi nag-pull over in siya. So I'm also gonna have this. And yeah, let's try it on. Alright, so I already tried it on. At <laughs> so this is how it looks like. For my footwear, I'm gonna have my Zara boots. Matagal ko nang nabili to. And I also wore this one in in Paris. But para masulit siya, I'm going to wear this one again. Alright, so I'm ready and this is my quick outfit check. I was actually thinking of trying on a blazer but para matchy matchy kami ni Jeff, ito na lang yung susuotin ko kasi wala siyang blazer. And, and for my bag, I'm going to wear this guest bag para marami siyang malagyan. Madadala ko dito ang wallet ko and every other necessities that we have to bring and oh by the way meron pa rin parang outfit check si Jeff so this is huh? that I didn't say that hey come here come here machi machi tala yeah we're machi machi a day in my life as a work from home mom, solo parent edition. Good day everyone! So first day of gala namin ngayon sa Hong Kong and we got ready na to visit Ngong Ping Village today with Jeff. We walked around 4 minutes sa bus stop and luckily double-decker yung bus na nasa kinamin. So we went sa taas to see the overlooking view sa labas and Jeff and I really enjoyed it. We transferred to a subway train and used the octopus card we bought yesterday. And makikita nga dito kung magkano na lang natirang load mo sa card then pwede ka naman mag-reload sa any 7-Eleven stores or dito mismo sa mga train stations nila. We took the train bound for Tongchong Station and nagbus na lang kami papunta sa itaas. We took bus 23 at mga 45 minutes rin siya. We visited the Ngongping Village and naglibot-libot kami and bought a fishbowl dito na 30 Hong Kong dollars or 225 pesos dito sa atin Hagoy. Pero masarap siya in fairness na ubus agad namin ito ni Jeff. Malaki ang area nila dito then famous na dito ang Big Buddha. So we took the stairs and climb up to the top pero kakasimula pa nga lang namin and nagreklam Si Jeff. <laughs> anyway, we were able to go to the top naman and ang laki nga ng Buddha and the view is so stunning at the top. After a few minutes of staying sa itaas, umalis na kami ni Jeff. May iba pa namang attractions dito pero hindi na namin pinuntahan kasi may entrance fees na. So we just headed back to the terminal and this time around, we are taking a cable car which we booked through Cloak. We chose the Crystal Cabin one-way ticket na 1,661 pesos for adult, 954 pesos naman for kids. And it was the best decision we took na pauwi na kami magi-cable car kasi kami lang dalawa dito at nasolo namin yung cable car talaga. Kung papunta ka kasi magtitake ng cable car, chances are meron kang makasabay ang strangers. The ride took 25 minutes to the terminal and glass rin yung floor nito. So makikita mo talaga kung gaano ka overlooking yung view at ang ganda ng Hong Kong. Then we stopped by to have our lunch dito sa City Gate Mall and we had ramen and dumplings with Jeff at malaki naman ang serving nila so we just shared kasi you know me kapag lunch hindi talaga ako masyadong kumakain at dinner person talaga ako. We paid around 1,200 pesos for that.
after dinner, agoy nakita ko man itong coach na store. And at first, patingin-tingin lang ako pero matagal ko na talagang gustong bumili ng wallet. So ayun, nabudol at nagpabudol nga rin ako dito. We went back to our hotel around 2pm and unboxed my little gift for myself. Kahit sa wallet, gusto ko talaga minimalist lang at maraming card slots at ito rin ang nagustuhan ko sa wallet na ito. We just took a rest for a bit, then went to Victoria Harbor to take some shots here and then pinaka-accessible way to go back sa hotel namin ay to take a fast craft na ginamit rin namin ang octopus card namin. And then took another bus na kapag double-decker, hagoy gusto na talaga ni Jeff sa itaas at front seat pa. We then decided to have our dinner here at Dim Dim Sum kasi nabasa ko nga na masarap daw yung Dim Sum nila dito at ang ganda kasi pwede kang umorder dito by scanning a QR code at sa phone ka nalang mag-order. Mostly sa mga restaurants na napuntahan namin ni Jeff, na notice ko na ganito ang style nila for ordering. Scanning sa QR code na lang and then you choose your meal and confirm your order then it will be served to you. We have this rice meal and sticky rice which is Jeff's favorite. It was served hot at 3 to 4 pieces ang kada serving nito. Sakto lang ang lasa at masarap rin. Then this one is my favorite rin na pork dumpling and this is well seasoned then may konting sabaw siya sa ilalim. Ito rin isang signature dumpling nila actually I forgot pero both sila masasarap. Six pieces yung isang serving nitong last order namin and medyo spicy siya so I enjoyed it personally. I would recommend this because this is just as good as well. Napakabusong na nga namin dyan at halos hindi na namin maubos kahit gaano pa kasarap. For all these orders, mga 2,000 pesos yung binayaran namin agoy ayoko nang mag-convert. We took a short bus ride para drop na kami sa tapat lang talaga ng hotel namin. May mura rin namang mga kainan dito ranging around 250 plus. When we headed back to our hotel, we got unready and prepared ourselves for tomorrow because guess what? It's our trip to Disneyland. It's gonna be a fun and magical experience to remember and that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!